CCSD's history of struggles has a big impact outside the classroom. Tonight, we look at why making changes in education will help limit the jobs that are passing us by. And this is our game room. This is a place a lot of people would want to work. Ping pong is very popular at Geotab. <laughs> Are you any good? Uh, no, <laughs> I'm terrible. So I stay away from the ping pong table uh -huh. altogether. From ping pong to free taco day. <laughs> Fleet management company Geotab is passionate about creating a happy work environment. Through its GPS devices, it helps clients around the world track more than 1.2 million of their vehicles, such as tractor trailers and delivery trucks. And there's 2.4 million hours driven today just today today well, along with the tacos the ping pong table you also notice something else here at geotab empty desks right now there are some 39 job openings here they're trying to fill we um, understand that finding the employees just in las vegas could be a challenge but you know we recruit globally and that is an issue jeremy aguero is an analyst who studies the clark county school district and business needs and if the challenge that they run into is that they can't find enough workers to help them meet those demands that they have, that will limit our ability to grow as a state. Aguero contends that CCSD is a remarkably important pipeline for local businesses looking to expand and also other companies looking to relocate here. When we talk to companies that are considering relocating to Nevada, uh, inevitably, it's questions about the depth of the workforce, the quality of the workforce, the education system, and then water. Meaning companies that look at CCSD's low rankings may pass us by for other cities. In the meantime, local companies like Geotab are left to look sometimes outside the valley to hire, even if that takes more time. Um, if we want to just go hire 100 people today, um, that would be great, but that doesn't really fulfill our needs. Well, now Aguero adds that CCSC has made significant strides in recent years. He points to some of the career and technical academies. He says that they are excelling in ways we really only could have wished for generations ago, and he believes that will help provide the workforce that companies are looking for.